हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज आशीष सैनी फ्रॉम इनोवेट योर सेल्फ वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल इन आवर टुडे सेशन वी विल लर्न हाउ टू ऐड द बटन्स टू योर चैट बोर्ड सो सिंपली वी आर गोना मेक अ चैट बोर्ड मोर अट्रैक्टिव सो इंस्टेड ऑफ राइटिंग द क्वेश्चंस और लेट्स से इंस्टेड ऑफ रिप्लाइंग टू द क्वेश्चंस व्हाट वी विल डू इज वी विल जस्ट गिव द ऑप्शंस टू द यूजर टू जस्ट सेलेक्ट द बटन्स राइट सो दिस इज हाउ वी आर गोना डू टुडे सो फॉर दैट व्हाट we are going to do is let's see what we have done lastly so here you can see this is one screenshot of what we have done lastly so in this here you can see i was like saying hi with respect to that the bot was replying and with respect to that you were also replying and after that the bot was asking you some question let's say what would you prefer veg or non veg so this is one question uh, which i can take an example for our today's session so in this what uh, we are having is we are having two options vegetarian and the non vegetarian so this is one way of doing or uh, let's say this is one way of asking the question to the user instead of doing this what we can do is we can give the options or let's say we can offer the buttons to the user so that the user can directly click on that button and on the basis of that the bot will reply right so this is how we are going to do today so for that let's go back to the program and we will see how we are going to do this today so for that firstly let's clear this in our mind like this is what this is a question from a bot side so simply the bot will ask this question to the user and on the basis of that your bot will uh, give reply to the user right so for that we have to go to the domain file so i am inside the domain file only and inside that i am going to focus on this question which is what would you prefer vegetarian or the non vegetarian so this is the question on which i am going to focus and i want to change this question or let's say i want to modify this question so that instead of passing just the question the bot will ask the question in the form of buttons so for that let's say i will keep this question up to this point so what would you prefer so this is one question right so for that let's just put it in the quotations right and after that as i have to add the button right so for that what i have to do is i have to add this argument which is buttons now press enter after that inside this button you are having some options the options that we are going to use is the first one is the title uh, the title which will be displayed to the user which the user will click and accordingly the bot will rep reply now here i am having the first options which is vegetarian so this is what i am going to do and the second option is the payload and here the payload is the term which we are going to link to the intent right so in short what i am going to do is when the user will click on this option so this is what a vegetarian or let's say this is an option which the user will say right so in that case let's say when the user will say vegetarian what does that means so when the user will say vegetarian the vegetarian means you are going to call the intent name vegetarian right so simply i'm going to call that intent so that your bot will respond according to this intent because we have made the story with respect to the intent values right so that is why i'm going to set the payload value here in this format and similarly i have to add the second option so i will just change this one and i will change it to non vegetarian and here i have to add the option or let's say i have to add the intent name with respect to the non vegetarian so for that let's check what's written here and that is non veg so just copy it and just paste it here right so for now i'm just taking two buttons so that's why i have just written two of it but if in case you want to add multiple buttons so at that time what you have to do you have to add more titles and the payload in this way so at that time what will happen it will add the button to your chatbot so this is how it will work now we are done with this now what we have to do 
we have to train the model because we have made the changes in the domain file so for that i have to train the model first so here you can see my environment is already activated and i'm already inside the project directory so for that i will just directly write rasa train uh, so simply what it will do is it will just train the model for you right so here you can see i haven't made any changes inside the stories and the nlu data part so that's why i didn't uh, change over there but still after doing all these things it has made the changes in the main domain file and with respect to that it has created a new model for me and now when i will run that rasa x at that time it will use the latest model and with respect to that what it will do it will uh, show you this options when you will ask the waiter or let's say to the bot so in at that time the bot will respond you with this question what would you prefer and the options will be in the form of buttons now let's not uh, talk all the things theoretically let's check it so for that let's just type rasa x now press enter Okay, again it hasn't selected the file so just select the model and make it active now go to talk to your bot now here you can see we are here now what we have to do is we have to just uh, write the hi uh, and with respect to that your bot will respond so let's say hi and the bot will reply how can I help you sir now I will ask what can I get to eat here so here you can see the bot has replied with two options and this time these two options are what these two options are the buttons and now for this you don't have to write the value you can write that value or let's say you can also specify that you want the vegetarian food or something like that but for now you don't have to write all the things because now you have the options whether vegetarian or the non-vegetarian so let's say this time i want to click on the non-vegetarian part so click on non-vegetarian so it will send this non-veg intent for that and with respect to that it has just given this and now here you can see we have egg curry chicken curry masala something something so it will give you the complete menu right so in this way you can see we have used the button part and that part is working very fine and also you can see it is looking very attractive in this way right so this is how we are going to use the buttons with your chatbot and that is a rasa chatbot actually right so this is how we are going to work now let's just finish this conversation uh, let's say i want one hickory okay so is there anything else no i don't want anything else and that's it so thanks we will get your order shortly so this is how your complete rasa chatbot will work right i hope everything was very clear to you regarding the topic buttons and still if you are having any queries or any doubts in the topic regarding uh, these buttons so don't hesitate and just leave a comment below in the comment section i will definitely uh, have a look on that and definitely will resolve your issues as soon as possible so if you have liked this video then please click on the like button and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet then please subscribe to my channel so that you do not miss any of my videos until then bye bye and thanks for watching this video